no, you poor guy. Nothing to say to you, Sally. What's up, agents? How y'all doing? Hope everybody's hanging in there, being as safe as you guys need to be. So, uh, oh, excuse me. <clears throat> so, we have the second week of the manhunt. Now, they're bringing it to us, like, three weeks later. Four weeks later. But, uh, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and do it. And, in fact, what I'm gonna do... We're going to see how far in it we can get with the Fire Marshal Bill build. So we got our capacitor, our uh, P416 with Perpetuation. That's the big one right there. So we're rocking the, uh, the Ninja bike so that we can hopefully get a bit more of the, uh, a little bit more of that burn going. We like to use three pieces of the uh, zero set so I'm gonna opt for the Caesars guard with the perfectly skilled in hopes of having the turret downtime being minimal and then we're gonna be using the drone to hopefully help proc that as well uh, you guys saw the build before we talked about using the artificer hive uh, you can do it but it's not practical in a lot of situations running solo I'm gonna be running solo so we're giving this a shot. I don't know how it's going to work out. I'm going to try to use this as long as possible uh, to do as much of the manhunt as I can. If all else fails, then we'll probably move over to the Bionic Commando. But I think, uh, I think we're going to be able to pull it off with this. I uh, will note we are using the skill duration mods, and that is simply to keep the... It doesn't help the burn duration, but it keeps the duration of the turret up. And that just, uh, I find that that helps us out a bit. We are a little more dependent on skilled, so you know, you gotta figure out, I'm still playing with it. I might end up ultimately going with skill cooldown, with skill haste or whatever in all three slots. But uh, yeah, for right now, skill duration, skill duration, and skill duration. All right, let's do it. I don't even know what we're doing. What are we doing? The taxi graveyard, oh, okay. Oh, it sounds like somebody's already here. What? Okay, they we got our skilled. So now, whenever something goes down. What we try to do is do them both at the same time. That thing getting pretty far down there. Wait, where is it? Alright. Oh. That's 
enemy patrol detected. Heavily armored hostile detected. So, definitely not the most efficient build, but uh, can't argue it doesn't work. All right, what's next? I don't want to come upstairs, okay? Oh, okay. perfect. Thank you. That's your target. Here we go. 
Pretty easy as long as we're in confined quarters. Actually, this build Target kicked down. ass. Good job. We just need to get upstairs. Once we're up top, it's going to be way easier. So, I think what needs to happen, we need to get here. I need to get the drone. in there. Hello? Is anyone there? They're keeping me at Columbia Plaza. Agent, if you can hear this, please get me the hell out of here. So, like, this is going to be an interesting one, right? Because it's like, alright, where do we... And then the drone has to handle over here, on the left side. Alright, he's on. He's on fire again. Alright. Not mad about that. Oh, dude, I didn't even see them over there. I'm trying to get a, a perpetuation shot off, but really, I don't care. There must be something mechanical. 
Or just a fast moving dude. Target spotted, Sheriff. Let's see, I got the next one ready, so. Oh yes! Oh yes! Oh shit, motherfucker! Did you really try that? That's beautiful. I love it. I do hope they try to rush me. Oh, then I don't. I do not hope I pop out of cover like that when they do. Oh, dude, no, no, no. Really? Are you really gonna do it? That's right. Oh wait, who shot me? Who shot me? one bad guy at a time nicely done sheriff the best was when it was reanimated so they would kick you into the screen and you didn't know if you'd come out of the screen and still be alive that was this is just glass cannon uh, tech support so we don't have to do anything to proc it the skills proc it themselves keep the mop in our hand we got in sync so we can proc some damage if we want to like against a big boss or something for the most part we just want it for the armor on kill um, two pieces of Hanayu, one piece of Wyvern, three pieces of Empress International. And dude, this is the easiest fucking build in the game. That's obviously illustrated by my, uh, my green to gold build. I'll probably revisit that pretty soon, do a new video. Feels like every day that I want to record something, it's just so fucking hot for no reason. And then I remember, oh, it's because it's California.
bitch. So we got we got our boy Mel. All right, agents. What I will say is, my honest opinion, it's all the same old same old stuff. Just reskinned as this hostage rescue thing. Uh, I am stoked on that new Exuro uh, gear set. I like that they finally gave us something that we can use with the fire turret. It makes it fun. If built right, it's a uh, it's actually usable in in-game awesome. content. Point identified. Uh, I definitely wouldn't use it solo in-game content, but it it certainly made running the manhunt stuff more fun. Yeah, there's a lot of builds that are more efficient, but uh, it is fun to play with this, and you do have to play strategically. So I would recommend giving it a shot if you like a little bit of a challenge and you like using skill builds. So. Uh, other than that, I'm underwhelmed by this three week wait until we got uh, this next portion of the manhunt which it seems like they're just biding time and you know I know it's an old game so I'm not not hating on them it's just uh, being honest you know there's not a not a whole lot to it all right you all be as safe as you need to be out there and I will catch you all in the next one peace out everybody mm -hmm.